the order of this x matrix is 51 cross 2 so 51 rows and two columns first step is to calculate x transpose in excel this can be done by first calculating this x transpose matrix look at the dimension of this x matrix so its dimension is 51 rows two columns so if you take its transpose it will be two rows 51 columns so changing rows into column is called the transpose it's good able to write the order or dimension of resultant matrix below that matrix so now we need to calculate this x transpose before calculating it make sure you need to highlight the required number of rows and number of columns so currently the order of this x transpose matrix is 2 rows 51 columns so you need to select 2 rows so currently we are in column m and row number 34 and 35 so we have selected 2 rows and 1 column m so we need to select 51 columns press the shift key and press the right arrow key and this here you can see that we have selected so far 2 rows and 27 columns keep going till 51 columns so here it is 2 rows and 51 columns once you are done highlighting the required number of rows and columns put an equal sign it will get typed at the first row and first column position and now since we need to take transpose so just type transpose so this array means the matrix x because we are interested in taking the transpose of this matrix x x matrix starts at b2 and it goes up to c52 close the parenthesis instead of pressing enter key press control key keep pressing it down and then press the shift key keep pressing it down as well now you have two keys pressed and then press enter key so it means you need to press control shift and enter three keys simultaneously once you do this you will see that the first column which was vector of ones has now become the first row and similarly the second column become second row so this is how a transpose can be taken within this excel spreadsheet so now if you look at this formula we have calculated this x transpose now multiply this x transpose with x matrix so right here x transpose x so now again you need to add the dimension of this x transpose x matrix below it so look at the first matrix it is x transpose and its dimension is 2 rows 51 column so right here 2 rows 51 column 2 cross 51 and then after a space the second the dimension of this second matrix which is x so its dimension is 51 rows and 2 columns so now in order to calculate the dimension of this product x transpose x the middle 51 will get cancelled and the resultant matrix will have two rows the number of rows in first matrix and the number of columns in second matrix so its order will be 2 cross 2 so it means now in order to calculate this x transpose x you need to highlight you need to select two rows and two columns so currently we are in column m and row number 38 and now I have selected an, another row 39 and column N as well so we have selected two rows and two columns once you are done with the selection put an equal sign and then type M M stands for matrix M U L T mult for multiplication so this is the command Excel to calculate the product of two matrices M mult and now the first argument the array 1 it is X transpose and comma array 2 it is this x matrix so x transpose select this full range and put a comma here so this is m34 to bk35 and then the second argument is array 2 which is this x matrix so x matrix is here at the top so it starts at b2 and it goes till c52 so once you are done with this so here are the calculations so b2 to c52 close the parenthesis and again you need to press control shift and enter simultaneously press the control key then press the shift key and finally press the enter key so here is the result x transpose x so now the next step is to calculate this we have x transpose x so now we need to calculate its inverse x transpose x whole inverse 
luckily we have the command for finding inverse of a matrix in excel as well so x transpose x inverse cap sign minus 1 we have this matrix x transpose x its dimension is 2 cross 2 we need to take inverse of a 2 by 2 matrix recall that inverse of a 2 by 2 matrix is 2 by 2 so it means you need to highlight two rows and two columns in order to calculate inverse of this x transpose x so put an equal sign and then type m for matrix by the way excel is case insensitive you can type the commands in small letters and even you can type the commands in capital letters i'm just using the capital letters because it is good to eyes m inverse and select this x transpose x matrix m38 to m39 close the parenthesis control shift enter simultaneously so this completes this first part x transpose x whole inverse